Okay, hi Year 11. So this is another revision video coming to you. This week's just a short one and it's about a technique called dual coding. Now, dual coding is all about using pictures to help you remember uh, key aspects of a topic. Now, it won't necessarily work for everything, but have you ever heard the expression, a picture is worth a thousand words? Well, some people remember things through visual links. So what I mean is, let's look at this, uh, this diagram of uh, photosynthesis. So some people will just be able to see bullet points and just understand it. However, using a diagram like this to support the topic. So in this case, we've got the image of the sun. We've got the image of the tree. We've got the image of the water. OK, so we know that the tree uh, needs these aspects. Now, carbon dioxide, oxygen and glucose, they're a bit more difficult to add diagrams to. But this can immediately help us to remember it, because when we're in that exam and we're thinking, what is photosynthesis? We can picture this diagram and think, right, there was a sun, there was a tree, there was water droplets and then there was the other arrows. So this diagram can help you to remember this key concept. Now, I know you use this in history because I've got some history examples here. So uh, this is a timeline for early Elizabethan England and this is from our school. So using um, pictures to go with what's happening. So, for example, when Elizabeth is crowned, we've got the image of the crown there. OK, so the more you can come up with in terms of pictures, the better. So you notice on this slide here, we've got pictures to go with on this screen here, pictures to go with the text just to help us remember. Now, these might ne not necessarily be the best pieces of art in the world. OK, we've got a stick figure up the top here, but it can all help us to, to visualize the material. So, like I said, I know you use this in history, but can you use it in other subjects? Well, yes, you can. Now, let's take business, for example. Let's just say there's a topic that you're really, really struggling with. You have tried to memorize using cue cards. You've tried to just learn the text, but it's not going in. And this is where you can try dual coding. So I've done this for business. Now, cost. I need to somehow remember that the cost is the money spent on making the product. So I've got the, the planks of wood there to symbolize the materials that we would need to buy. The price is how much the customer pays for the product. So I've got that for sale sign. And then the profit is how much money the business makes. So I've then got the wallet full of money. Now, all of a sudden, this and these diagrams can help me to understand this concept by using these pictures. So this is just a little quick way that you can uh, help to remember things. Now, like I say, it doesn't work for everything, but give it a try. Try making a diagram for a topic you might be struggling to remember and see if that helps you. OK, take care and I'll speak to you next time. Bye bye.